State on breaking news, the portion of I-75 in Manatee County closed because of a fatal accident involving a construction crane is finally back open. Reporter Sarah Rosario has been on the scene for much of the day. She joins us now with more on what caused that crash and what we're learning about the driver. Yeah, crews worked for most of the afternoon to remove this crane barreling off the road and into this ditch 150 feet down after a tire blew here on the interstate, killing the driver. We're told that driver was headed southbound when it happened just before exit 228 in Parrish. FHP hasn't released the driver's name, but we're told he's a father of a one-year-old and a husband. His boss, almost too upset to talk with us, tells us he worked for this company for the past three years and will be missed. He was a fantastic family family man. He did everything for his family. It was everything was about his family. He will truly be missed. And this on ramp here behind me onto 75 blocked off with cones and state troopers right now has been closed for the past several hours. Traffic onto 75 southbound has been diverted. There's no other impact to traffic for drivers headed southbound this afternoon. Reporting in Manatee County, Sarah Rosario, ABC Action News.